Merry Christmas, Kid Pack. Welcome back to another week of a Lone Star Christmas. We are so excited that you joined us today. We are preparing for our third year of the gingerbread building competition, and that will be next week. But this week, we have a special video for you. One person built their gingerbread house from home. That's Pastor Camille. She just had her baby, Bonnie, and she has been home for the past few weeks, but she graciously built us a gingerbread house, and you're gonna... You're gonna see how that goes. But make sure that you join us next week for the full gingerbread house building competition and enjoy this video. Bye, Quebec! What's up, Kid Pack? Pastor Camille and I am ready. I'm so excited because you know how great I am at this. My husband's gonna time it and apparently give, give me some challenges and I'm nervous. Starting in three, two, one, go. Okay. Oh, I don't even know what to do with this. This is a door. All right, we got a wall. All right, going significantly better than the last two times that I've done this. No, I, I spoke too soon. Well, it was upside down. It's not working. Oh, no, no! Everything's fine. I'm still competing, right? I get to win, like, if it's really good. Okay. It's Challenge number one. No, no, no. No, I'm not ready. Challenge number one, you have to be blindfolded for three minutes. Are you serious? No! Where's my icing? Oh, there it is. Is that doing anything? Yeah. I hate this. This is the worst. Um, is that even? Okay, it's time for the next challenge. No, it's not. You cannot touch anything with your fingers, only tools. So what are you gonna use? You can use tools, forks and spoons, but that's it for five minutes. What? Yep. What? What am I supposed to do with this? <laughs> well, this is just awful. All right, let's decorate the roof. This is impossible. <laughs> well, that's beautiful, look at that. This is great. How beautiful, look at that door. All right, so I need to figure out how, oh, I can't use my hands. I can't use my hands. Okay, all right. Okay, next challenge. Okay, can I use my fingers? Yeah, you can use your fingers. <gasps> okay. But if you answer this trivia question incorrectly, you no, lose hold on, just stop, minutes. just stop right there. He said the word trivia and everybody knows that's just rude to say to me. <laughs> In which country did gingerbread houses originate from? Germany. That's correct. What? You got 15 minutes left. My mousselage looks good. I'm not really sure where to put most of this stuff. Oh, there's a door. There's a door. Hmm. I'm gonna decorate this first because it's looking a little plain. Well, how cute is that? Let's make some windows because what mousselage doesn't have cute little windows, huh? I'm gonna do the roof real quick because it's looking super plain. All right. Mm. Oh, well that's ugly. Okay, well that's good enough. Kinda looks like spider webs, but oh well. Mm. <laughs> this is not very pretty. Icicles, pretty, pretty icicles. I'm telling you, this icing is much better than I've used in the past. Let's just see what this. Ah! Okay, next challenge. Okay. For the next five minutes, you have to wear oven mitts. Are you serious? Yep. What do you mean oven mitts? And it just so happens that we have the largest oven mitts that ever could be invented. But I was doing so good. We're gonna decorate the back because it's looking a little, a little plain. Let's write mousselage. Or not, let's not write that. I should never work at a bakery writing on cakes. Mary, it really doesn't like it says Mary, but Merry Christmas. <laughs> oh no. Isaac, we're pausing because we have to mix a bottle, but I'm not doing anything. You can... Okay, it's kind of dark. We need some lights. Ha. Back in business, everybody. So what am I doing? Oh, these are cute dots. Let's do some dots. Oh, I need to open. How am I supposed to open them? This looks dangerous. Kids, don't try this at home. Where there's a will, there's a way. We're good. <laughs> All right, let's try it. Ready? Nope. It's really hard to pick up these little gumdrops. <laughs> We're gonna have to bag you. Well, that didn't work. Okay, you can take the gloves off. Yay! 
Why? That was not fun. Get Next challenge, however. There's another challenge. Is to hold Bonnie for five minutes. While doing this? Yep. One-handed. For the last five minutes of the challenge. All right, boo. Ready? Here we go. Okay. How am I supposed to do this with the bears? Hold it, baby. Oh, and gingerbread. I'm working with my left hand here, and that's not good because I'm not left handed. You've heard of goat on a roof? This is bear on a roof. What do you think, honey? It's pretty good. Pretty good. This is a masterpiece. We're going to win. How much do we win if I win? Mm. Oh, that was not tasty. Oh, it's beautiful. I'm going to put some. That was that much. 10. Oh, no. We're outside. Seven. Six, Wait, five, I need a little snow on the moon's lunch. Oh my three, three, two, one. Okay. You're over. <gasps> okay. Wow. Bonnie, high five. Okay. Let's show the world this masterpiece. All right, guys. Hold on. All right. Here it is. Look at this beautiful moose lodge, guys. I'm so proud of myself. Here we go. That's the front, cute door. Here's the side. It's okay. And then this is Merry Christmas. All right. And then this side, we got this little guy on the this little guy on the roof. How cute. Wow, that's amazing. What a masterpiece. All right, now we're gonna pretend like I won. And I success and the winner is Master Camille. Thank you. Thank you to all who believed in me. I knew you believed Thank you. Thank you all. I love you all. Bye, keep back. <laughs>
I want to give you an opportunity right where you're at, in your living room, in your PJs, wherever you're at. I want to give you an opportunity to give your heart to God, to take up this gift of salvation. That while we're gifting something to God, he's giving us something so much better. So with every head bowed, every eye closed, if that's you this morning, that you are far from God or you haven't, you haven't really been leaning in and giving your time like you should be or giving your, your, your focus and attention to God like you should, that this is your moment. I want you to repeat after me. Say, Lord Jesus, I give you my life. I give you my heart. And Lord, I acknowledge you. I look to you. I see you as God over my life and God over this world. And I thank you for the sacrifice that you gave on Calvary. That you gave for me, that you died on a cross so that I may have eternal life because of your love for me. So I thank you for that sacrifice and I turn away from my sins so that I can pursue you to follow after you. We thank you for it. We praise you for it. In Jesus' name, amen. Love you guys. I hope you have an amazing Christmas. I'm super excited. It's incredible. I love me some Lone Star Christmas. Have a great day. See you later, Kid Pat. God bless. Thank <laughs> you.